look, we know what the fucking deal is here. The season's fucking over. Aaron Rodgers comes back. They win the next two games. That's it. They're the winners. It doesn't matter if Detroit wins their last two games. If Aaron Rodgers come back and wins his next two games, that means he beats they beat Chicago, and they win their last game. They're going to the playoffs. Listen, Aaron Rodgers was gone for seven, eight games. The Detroit Lions, with the talent that they have, should have been twelve and four this season. Twelve and four. I mean. Riola. I mean, these guys played their asses off. I mean, Riola, I could have just imagined this guy, he's been there through all the bad seasons. I saw him walk up the stairs, and I'm like, he's fucking disgusted. I mean, you know, I'm a Detroit Lions fan. It's, this is the worst fucking loss. I was looking at StubHub. I was thinking about going down there Monday night. Tickets were 300 fucking dollars to go to this game. Thank God that I didn't fucking blow my fucking cash. How many fucking fans do you think blew cash instead of fucking buying presents for their family? Because they thought the Lions were going to win today. Thank God I didn't do that dumbass shit. Jim Schwartz, you're fucking terrible. You fucking are garbage. You are not a fucking NFL pro coach. You are fucking straight trash. You have no fucking game plan for third down. You had no fucking game plan coming in this game. You finally did. You, you started fucking weak side blitzing from three weeks ago that you stole from the Cincinnati Bengals. And you fucking going to Calvin Johnson late in the game. You have a $94 million quarterback. And Matthew Stafford. And what do they do? They do no progression. They get fucking no quarterback coach to help this guy in his fucking accuracy. No wonder Calvin Johnson's dropping balls fucking left and right. You fucking... Stafford's accuracy is fucking terrible. He's setting up fucking all pro receivers up to get fucking slaughtered. That's why Calvin Johnson's dropping balls left and fucking right and you don't even know which way the fucking ball's coming you throw the interception the ball's fucking over here and these guys got to do all these fucking acrobats you got fucking receivers that are six 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 seven six eight you can't hit a motherfucking the only fucking guy you hit is furia who's six eight how the fuck can you miss him stafford is i mean he might be good but he's fucking terrible right now. And the fact that he does not have somebody mentoring him. His progression is fucking hasn't gone anywhere. It's like flatlined. And Jim Schwartz and his fucking bullshit monotone attitude about the team is fucking terrible. You know, they were showing Jim Schwartz in his press conference on ESPN. They cut his ass off. Went straight to Jim Harbaugh, uh, or John Harbaugh, the fucking professional coaching family. His dad was a coach. Jim is a coach. John is a coach. And you listen to both of these guys talk. You listen to Jim Schwartz. He sounds like a moron. Oh, we still got one game. You know, this was, was a setback. You know, I mean, fucking John Harbaugh is going through the progressions of the game, understanding how the game is progressing and giving out fucking game balls and explaining how they won that game. And to listen to Jim Schwartz is like listen to a fucking moron retard. Oh my God, you gotta fire this guy. Fire everybody in that fucking staff. They're terrible. The kicking team is fucking trash. The punting team is garbage. I mean, the defensive line are just playing on pure fucking talent. That's it. I mean, I'm going to give out kudos. I'm going to get one game ball out today, and I'm going to give a game ball to the fucking secondary for not giving up a touchdown. They played their asses off today. I don't know where it came from, but they played with pure talent. The defense didn't give up no touchdowns, still lost the fucking game. Fucking Stafford's accuracy got Pettigrew killed. Almost got Stafford a fucking broken neck paralyzed. This guy, he has zero accuracy. And if he's your franchise quarterback, which he is, 94 fucking million dollars, 
you need to go get a coach in there that is going to coach the team, coach, I mean, get somebody in there proper. Guy, go hire D'Antonio or somebody. Jesus, man. Jim Schwartz is not a head coach. Maybe at best, he's a, a defensive line coach. That's it. But he's not an offensive mind. He can't even game plan out of a wet paper bag. He's fucking trash. Please, stop wasting the talent in Detroit. I understand the Ford family don't give a fuck about the team because they own Ford Ford fucking Motor Company, and it's probably a big fucking write-off. But I'm tired of the Detroit fan. Look, if you don't want to fucking win, sell it to somebody else. Go buy Arena Football or some other fucking team. Write them off as a tax write-off. I'm tired of seeing the Lions lose. The Lions haven't won since the 1957 playoffs. Haven't won since then. They had a fucking front door seat. Fucking. Uh, front row. They could have walked into the playoffs. Walked in. Cutler hurt. Team sucks. <laughs> fucking the Packers are hurt. You haven't won in 20 years. If Jim Schwartz doesn't get fired this year, that's it. I'm going to burn everything I got in the Lions. I'm going to move out of the state of Michigan. I, I can't take it no more. This is the worst, the worst NFL football. It's, this is worse than the 0-16 team. At least we knew the Lions fucking sucked. God, you have tons of fucking talent up the ass, and you still can't win. You don't know how to make a game plan. Jim Schwartz does not know how to game plan a fucking professional football game. And doesn't know how to manage a professional fucking football game. He's fucking clueless. Please fire Jim Schwartz. Hire somebody with a fucking football pedigree. Pedigree. Whatever. Fuck it. Just go get somebody that knows what they're doing. This is, I mean, losing to um, the Baltimore Ravens, and they acted like they weren't even fucking worried. They're like, yeah, we got this. We're still going to win. Lions can't score. And then fucking Stafford dancing around like, like he's not in control. Don't know what the fuck's going on. And he is not, he, this guy is not feeling it. He's scared. He's playing scared. I don't know who your offense coordinator is, who the quarterback coach is, who your special teams coach is, and head coach. All need to be fired. All of them. The only person that is halfway decent is a defense coordinator for the Detroit Lions. That's it. Everybody else need to be fired. Period. Anyways, it was the worst fucking Monday night game. Worst game in the Lions. Worst clutch fucking failure at home you if you lose this game at home this means you're not going to win your next two games the other teams are going to smell fucking blood the new york giants they smell fucking blood they're like we're going to beat the lions and minnesota is on fire right now they just fucking stomped the shit out of the eagles and you think you're going to beat them at home in the last game of the season you're out of your fucking head you're going to get beat by a second string team and they're going to whoop your ass you're fucking trash Lions season is over. They're not going to the playoffs. Whoever goes, the Green Bay Packers or the Bears, it's probably going to be the Packers because the fucking uh, Bears, I mean, Jay Cutler's a pussy. He's going to choke anyway. So it's probably going to be Aaron Rodgers going to fucking, it's going to be the most amazing fucking story ever. He's going to win the last two games. He's going to come out of fucking sitting on his ass and he's like, I've been out seven games. How the fuck did we win the division? It's fucking incredible. Oh, my God, dude. Anyways, there's no pressure on him. There's going to be zero pressure on Aaron Rodgers when he wins this fucking division. You know why? It's not like the time when they were 15-1 and one and was stressed out. This motherfucker's coming back fresh as fuck. And they, like, we fucking got in the playoffs. We just got lucky. Ain't no pressure on them. And they're going to be fucking home field advantage the first game? Holy fuck, in the tundra? Oh, my God, dude. Uh, I just had it. I had it. It's it's a fucking total waste. Anyways, I'm out. Fuck the Lions. Fuck you, Jim Swartz. You're fucking trash.